After a very cold night here at Rentschler Field, the Yukon Huskies lost to the Cincinnati Bearcats 41-0. This was the first time the Huskies were shut out at home since 1978 when they lost to Navy. The Bearcats completed for five touchdowns and two field goals, with each touchdown being scored by a different Cincinnati player. The Huskies hoped starting sophomore quarterback Tim Boyle would help the offense, yet the only real chance that the Huskies had was a missed field goal in the fourth quarter from kicker Bobby Puyol. We had a chance to catch up with Coach Bob Diaco and quarterback Tim Boyle after the game. Let's see what they had to say. As hard as it is to lose and as sad as it is to lose, we're going to turn this into a positive. We're going to turn this into a teaching moment. Um, we're going to use every bit of this to our benefit to get better and do better and learn and grow. And we're going to get to work. We're going to grow our brotherhood through this adversity. And things are happening as they should. I believe that. I believe that. We've got a long way to go. We've got a lot of work to do. This adversity is going to create an unbreakable foundation for championships in the future. Obviously, it sucks to lose, but uh, it's a part of football. And uh, I think everyone in the locker room understands that. And uh, when it comes to the locker room, uh, there's obviously some people here and there who are negative, but it's up to the leaders and the, uh, the seniors to snap them out of it and just stay positive because we know that this is a process team and uh, you know, every week is a, is a stepping stone. The UConn Huskies hope to finish their season strong when they face Memphis next weekend and they face SMU on December 6th here at Rentschler. Reporting from Rentschler Field, I'm Cheyenne Baker, and this is UC Sports.